Good morning everyone, welcome to another video, what a way to start a new video, I'm looking like this, talking a little bit quietly because it's currently early and I think everyone else is still asleep so I don't want to wake anyone up, but I thought I would film a week in my life as it is my first like proper week of uni, I've just had freshers week and we've had like introductory lectures and that kind of thing, but this is my first actual like content week of uni, so I thought I would do a week in my life from Monday to Friday just to show you what the first week of uni is like and what it's like studying nutrition. I have just got back from the gym as you can tell, I went to an early half six class because I have a full day from nine till six. I've got a bit of a gap in the middle but my only problem is that all my lectures are at the other sort of campus. On the campus that I'm at it's basically just accommodation so and it takes like it's about 25 minute walk over there and then the buses are always just so packed and not the most reliable. I'm hoping they might be more reliable this week as terms properly starting but we will see. So there's not really much chance to come back in between. I know by six o'clock tonight when I get back here, I will not be feeling like going to the gym. So I thought, you know what, I'd rather get up a bit earlier and go instead. I just did a grit strength class, which is basically like a hit style workout using weights and then also a lot of cardio exercises. It's only 30 minutes, but of a high intensity, as you can tell from the current color of my face. I did have make myself some overnight oats yesterday. So I've got those good to go this morning. So I'm gonna quickly grab some breakfast, then get ready. I've got just less than an hour till I need to leave. I did actually manage to track down the Pippin Nut Pumpkin Spice Almond Butter yesterday. So I'm excited to give this a go on my breakfast this morning. It literally smells like something Christmassy. It's sort of like cinnamon, ginger, all kind of smells like that. I don't think it's got ginger in it, but it does remind me of something very Christmassy. Our kettle is also currently broken, so I'm having to heat up water on the hob, which takes a while because this hob takes forever to heat up as well. I've even been prepared and made myself a lunch to take as I'm going to be out all day. I've just made like a Mexican quinoa kind of mix thing, so I'll have that with me to eat later for lunch. So I have just made it back in from my first full day of lectures. It's currently just gone half six. Finished today at six, so it was a late one and it's already gone dark outside, which wasn't the best when walking back it's gonna be so sad when it gets like dark at like four half three whatever it is in the winter I'm not prepared for that but basically just had loads of sort of introductory lectures today so nothing too intense it was just a long day though especially after waking up super early this morning to go to the gym but i'm so glad i did that this morning because i would not have the energy for it now and i knew that would probably happen so that's why i was like i'm happy enough to wake up an hour earlier and go to the gym class then so Glad I did that. Oh my god, what is this bit of hair doing? <laughs> Good, try and ignore that. I'm just gonna quickly sort out some stuff I got given today and get my bag and stuff ready for tomorrow in a bit. But also gonna go and make some dinner. And yeah, and then just have a really chill night. Probably get an early night because I am just shattered. This bit of hair is really annoying me. There we go. But anyway, yeah, I'll probably get a really early night tonight or I'm hoping I'll just sleep so well tonight after today and at least tomorrow my lectures don't start till 10. So, a little bit of a later start tomorrow which will be good. been on a run I did have to cut it a bit shorter so normally I would always do a 5k and then try and improve on speed each time this morning though my alarm went off at 7 so I had plenty of time to get up a run I don't um leave I don't start today until 10 so I have to leave here about 20 past 9 so I was like oh that gives me plenty of time I can like get myself ready be out the door at least by half seven half an hour run and then I've got at least a good hour or so to get ready but then I fell back to sleep for half an hour, so that kind of happened and I thought, you know what, I'm going to cut it short because if not I'm going to be rushing around like crazy. I might already be rushing a bit, hopefully not, but yeah, if I did leave it then I would be literally rushing around like crazy this morning. So I thought, you know what, I'll cut it slightly shorter, but it did mean that I ran slightly faster at a faster pace than I normally did. I think having in mind it was shorter helped like, push me go faster. So I did do that, I still got in, I think it was three and a half kilometres, so only 1.5 shorter than I normally would do, so still a good run this morning to wake me up, 
but yeah i need to get some breakfast get myself all ready now for the day and today i have got two lectures i think i've also got a tutorial which is supposed to be two hours long which seems kind of long considering we've already met our tutors as well so i'm hoping that might be a little bit shorter i will see and then i've got a two hour lab at the end of the day so i finish at five today which is a lot better than six o'clock yesterday and hopefully it won't yet be dark when i'm walking back later so i will see just realized how crazy my hair is looking but i've just made it back in yeah i don't know it wasn't a french plait but um <laughs> it's kind of all fallen out now and i have just blown my nose as well <laughs> it's looking kind of red but it has just gone oh no it's caught past five now so I actually finished earlier today, finished about like half four in the end, so I got back here at five, just stopped by reception though to pick up some posts, so I got a washing rack, just always needed, I am thinking of doing some laundry tomorrow, and a lot of my Gymshark leggings can't go in the tumble dryer, so I need somewhere to hang them, so I ordered one of these off of Amazon, and then I've also done a Boohoo order, but I am thinking of filming a haul over on my main channel, I have also ordered some stuff from Misguided, which will hopefully arrive in the next day or two, so... I'm thinking of doing a Boohoo and Misguided haul over on my main channel, so if you want to see that, make sure to subscribe and turn on my notifications so that you know when that goes up, and you can see that it'll probably go up, I'm trying to think when this video will go up, maybe about a week's time, I can't think when I've planned to put that one up, but it will be up not too long after this one goes up, so yeah, be sure to subscribe if you want to see that one. I am now going to just finish off a bit of sort of uni stuff that I need to do from finishing off from today today's sort of notes and then um following on into what I need to do ready for tomorrow and oh yeah today I had um a biochemistry lecture which I was a bit lost in I'm not gonna lie I did chemistry up to GCSE bear in mind I was 16 at the time when I did that and I'm nearly 21 now so it was a long time ago so I was pretty lost in that one so I kind of need to look back over that but at least tomorrow I've got a freer day so I'm hoping tomorrow I can dedicate some time to go through that a bit more slowly and get to grips with that so I'll leave that for tomorrow but I just need to finish off a bit of stuff from today and then I'll probably make some dinner in like an hour or so's time. Oh also good good side note though however today is bake-off which is always the best so I'm excited for that that's on at eight so got a bit of time to get everything done and get sorted before that starts and that'll be a nice way to end the day and a nice relaxing evening. Good morning everyone it is Wednesday today and I'm currently just rushing out the door to go to the lecture I've only got one today from nine till ten so get it over with but I need to kind of leave now so I'm in a bit of a rush this morning but I then do have a bit more of a free day today, so I'll probably get some uni bits done. I'm thinking of getting like, my washing done, gonna head to the gym, gonna probably get some filming and editing done, work on a bit of YouTube stuff as well. But we'll see where the day goes, but for now I need to get heading out. Just recently got back in from uni, it's so good being done for the day already because, yeah, the last few days have like been quite long. It seems like it's been a really long week and it's only halfway through so far, but so good to be done. So I'm now gonna head to the gym for a bit. I'm definitely gonna do more of like an upper body session today because my like legs and particularly like my glutes are killing still from Monday. I think it must have been, I don't know why, they're just really hurting still. So I'm definitely gonna be more of an upper body focus today. So I'm gonna get on my way there and then when I get back, I think I'm gonna get into sorting out my laundry, just finishing off a bit of uni stuff and then hopefully have some time to get on with some filming and editing as well. And this is why I'm currently needing to get some washing done. There's literally so much that's built up. That's the problem with having like gym clothes and day clothes as well. It soon all piles up, especially at this time of year as well. When you've got loads of bulky jumpers, so I have to just wash my hair. So that's what I've kind of got this towel. I'm going to take it out of this so now and nip over, shove all of this into the washing machine. Finally, just been to collect all of my washing. This is always the annoying bit though. Sorting it all out now because I don't mind doing it, but... So putting it of putting it away, which always takes forever. I've just been getting some uni notes done, also quickly grabbed some lunch while that was sorted. I mean the machine takes like half an hour to do the washing and it's about an hour to dry it. So it's a long process also going to and from the laundry and then sorting it all out as well. So gonna try and attempt to do that now. Also a little tip though, if you want to avoid ironing too much, I always get it straight out the tumble dryer, hang any t-shirts or anything up straight away while they're nice and warm and that like decreases any kind of creasing in them and stuff so you don't have to iron it lazy hack there for you but we get on with that now and then carry on with a bit more uni work and then hopefully get on to some youtube stuff 
Also just got an email through to say that my misguided parcel has been delivered. So I've got my booby one and my misguided one now. So hopefully this afternoon I can get round to filming my haul, which I'm hoping to get done. Also while it's still light, I'm not a fan of these darker evenings and it's just going to keep getting worse. But hoping to film that while I've sorted some light. I do have my ring light as well, but it's also nice to have, nice to have a bit of natural light coming in too. I've got a little bit of a cold coming on though. I think my nose is a bit blocked, so I might sound a bit nasally, but... Hopefully I might just go pick that up and get um, that video filmed, that would be good. Just been out to collect my um, misguided parcel and it's just started raining. Luckily it just started um, not long before I <laughs> went out to go and get it. So I'd already realised I took an umbrella with me but my legs have still kind of got me <laughs> bit damp and it's not the nicest but at least I've picked up those, uh, that misguided parcel now so I'm gonna sort my hair out because it's still a bit of a mess after I've washed it and then hopefully I can film my haul video is what I'm gonna hope to do next because I managed to finish off all the uni work that I have to do for today. Just finished filming my haul and I mean this is literally so much packaging that I've now got through I mean, I can get keeping the clothes nice, but literally everything is individually wrapped and it mounts up to so much, which is so bad. They should really stop doing that. Like, the one outside thing should be enough and they could put, like, a bit of tissue paper or something maybe in between to separate, but, yeah, I've ended up with a lot of rubbish now. Just filmed my haul video and unfortunately quite a few of the items were a little bit big, so I'm going to have to return them. I did quite like a lot of them, though, so it was, like, good for the haul. It wasn't that I didn't dislike them, but some of them are just not the right size, unfortunately. I might, I'll see, I'll return these and then I might reorder or resize some of the things that weren't quite right, but I will have to see. At least there's a post office over on the other uni campus, so tomorrow hopefully I'll be able to drop that off. Good morning, everyone. It is Thursday today, which means almost at the weekend, only a couple more days to go, slowly getting there. This week seems to have definitely been a long one. At least today I have only got a couple of things. I've got a lecture this morning at 10, so not too early of a start. And then I've got a lecture this afternoon from 2 till 4, and that's a two hour biochemistry one. So that will probably be quite intense, especially in the afternoon, because for German in the afternoon my focus is gone, but hopefully we'll all be okay. I have definitely got a cold coming on. Last night I just started to feel not the best. I was super tired and just a bit headachey and really bunged up, as you can probably tell from my voice. I still got quite a blocked nose this morning, but it's not as bad as I thought it would be, so I'm hoping that getting an early night and decent night's sleep last night will have helped. And then tonight at least I'm finished by four, so I might go to the gym when I get back. I thought of going this morning before going, and I was like, no, I just need a good sleep this morning, so I might go to the afternoon when I get back. I'll see how my energy's doing and how I'm feeling as well. Um, even if it's just for a bit, I might go this afternoon. Um... But yeah, so at least I have an earlier finish as well today, which means I will be able to get another early night, hopefully, and just really kick whatever this cold is. I have just made it back in. I think that two hours of biochemistry today pretty much finished me off. I'm so tired now. It's currently just gone half four, though, so it's still not that late in the day. But I am just sort of going to take a bit of time to unwind. I'm not looking forward to seven hours of lectures tomorrow, so I'm going to definitely have quite a chilled night tonight. But before I do... I'm gonna head to the gym in a bit. I'll probably get there in another like 20 minutes or so, but I'm just gonna have some time to dissociate from work and stuff and then head to the gym, probably do lower body today, I think, and then probably get back, make some dinner, get some work bits that I need to get done ready for tomorrow. So yeah, still got a bit of a long night ahead of me, but hopefully I'll get through it. <laughs> and then yeah, tomorrow will be a full on day. I am so ready for the weekend. I did also receive my Desenio order, I don't know if I mentioned about this or not, but I ordered some prints to put on this board, so I got that through, I don't know whether I'll have time to sort them out today, but maybe tomorrow, if not, definitely some point over the weekend, I am excited to get into this, if I do open it at all, then I will show you what they're like. Good thing about today though is that the new season of Riverdale has just started, so I've just been catching up with that while I've been eating my dinner, let me know if you watch it and what you think of the season so far, by this by the time this goes up, either one or two, maybe a couple of episodes might be out by now. Let me know what you're thinking though so far and if you are currently watching it or if you're not, definitely go over and check it out. I've just opened up my Desenio prints, so I thought I would show you quickly. I thought I was, I mean I kind of wanted them to be a little bit bigger. I didn't really know because I didn't have any kind of measurement 
a way of measuring <laughs> when I ordered them, but they still look good all the same anyway. So I've got this one which says live more, worry less, and it's got like a pink background with palm leaves on it, and I just thought that was really pretty. And then I've just got this sort of hand-drawn heart, and then there's this pink Paris Chanel bottle. Then over here I've got one that says sweet dreams. This one which has got a pale pink background which says find what feels good and then this one which says love. So I thought that these three all sort of like connect well together so I'm thinking of putting them up on the board like this. I don't know if I'll do it now but I will see. Let's see how it goes because it is a massive board to fill as well but at least there'll be something to put on it anyway. I've just popped the prints up and I think... Yeah, it would be better if they were slightly bigger, but what I'm thinking of doing is possibly printing off some photos and then filling in the edge with photos. I think could look quite nice, so I'm going to do that, but at least I've got something on it for now. But yeah, definitely thinking of getting some photos printed that might look quite nice around the edge. Good morning everyone, it is Friday today and I am about to get on my way to uni. I've got a full day from 9 till 6 today. I get an hour off in the middle for lunch and I think an hour off this afternoon. Besides that, this morning it's solidly from 9 to 1 and I also have 3 hours of biochemistry today which I'm not looking forward to after the 2 hours basically killing me off yesterday but anyway, I'm going to get heading there now as I need to get on my way if not I'm going to be late but you'll probably see me later looking half dead and very, very tired Finally, I just made it back in from a very long day and I'm surprised I'm not why is that? How's the street light reflecting off my face? It's already gone dark out I'm going to close my curtains because I feel like people can see in it's dark but yeah I have just finished up my very long day I'm surprised I'm not more tired than I am because I thought I'd be coming back in dead today but surprisingly I feel more awake than I did yesterday does somebody make sense but had had a long day so I think I am going to get some dinner now probably just going to make a quick stir fry it's got to that point in the week where there's just loads of random mitts left in the fridge as I did my food shop at the weekend so I'm just going to chuck anything and everything in the saucepan and make some kind of stir fry I'm thinking or some pasta dish kind of feeling like a stir fry then so I think that's what I'm gonna go for and not planning on doing any work tonight there is Bake Off Extra Slice though so I'm wanting to watch that and also MasterChef Final so that should be very good too oh, just yawning but I've just been what have you been doing I've just been watching some tv and I am now gonna get to bed because I am sleepy but I thought I would just round up this video here as that is, that is my week. I've got through my first week. So I hope you have enjoyed this video. Smash a big thumbs up on it if you have. As well as be sure to... That doesn't even make sense. But also, yeah, be sure to click on the little red subscribe button down below if you're new to my channel. As that would mean so much to me if you could do that. And don't forget to also tap on that notifications bell too so that you're notified whenever I upload. Also, be sure to let me know down below in the comments if you'd like to see future videos like this. More week in my life style videos either at uni or when I'm off on holiday holiday or anything like that really but yeah i will be sure to see you very soon with a brand new video bye